What's it say?
convenient nowadays. You caught me. Good evening, Spriggan.
That's a wrap. Reward deposited. Yes, it should be perfect. Parabolic shards expanded, initiating satellite communications. Indeed, Vern aided in its development, and the President of Calvert has given its use his tacit approval. As long as we continue reporting data on its usage, admittedly. That's correct. I don't believe communicating using Basel's orbital network to be safe at this point in time. As a Code E matter, the main AI in our headquarters will begin analysis and threat level determination as soon as it has received the proper data. <sighs> Something about that just doesn't sit right with me. Sure. Loud and clear, Professor Arkride. I was forced to grapple with that damn tyrant. I know what I'm doing on that front. By all means. Whether it's permitted under our company rules is a gray area. But that is the Arkride Solutions way, isn't it? So I've noticed. Good evening, everyone. I'm sorry for bothering you so late. I thought you would be in for the night by now. Preparations are coming along nicely. This is going to be fun. Much as I wish we didn't have to leave most of the execution to that filthy worm. He is an overseer much like myself. I am sure he will play his role perfectly. Just take care not to let the window of opportunity pass you by. Hmm. Who do you think you're talking to, puppeteer? As if I would fail. This battlefield will soon be an essential part of the preparations for our endgame. I will be looking forward to seeing what you can do as well, Golden One. I shall do whatever my contract asks of me. Farewell for now.
There you are. I'm glad you all came. Oh! I remember you too! I wasn't aware that you had already met. This is Associate Professor Esmeray, another one of Professor Hamilton's students. <laughs> That's me! My full name is Esmeray Archette. What a surprise! So you are the problem solvers I've heard so much about. And one of you is just too adorable! Please, Essie, this isn't the time for that. Um, I did tell her to go home, but she insisted on staying to help us. Hmm, why must you be so cold, Katra? I could never abandon my little brother in his moment of need. Little brother? We're just students under the same professor. What do you mean, just? Here's what you get for being so mean. Come here! <laughs> Stop that, please! Additional residual shards detected. Hmm, these readings are a little denser than before. Does that mean we're not alone? Yes, I wasn't imagining things.
Bobo Mud acts like a real ass dog. Uh, doesn't it? I spent many nights coding the design so it'd perfectly replicate a wolf's mannerisms. <laughs> Watch what you're calling me. <sighs> I was hoping not to make contact with you while I was here. But I see I underestimated just how friendly you would get with the faculty here in less than 24 hours. I did hear you had a way of conning everyone you meet into liking you, Arkride, but you work fast. <laughs> you think I'm enjoying this? Just get it off me! My name's Kayla McMillan. That's my real name, for what it's worth. I'm a second lieutenant in the CID, and I'd prefer it if that and all we discuss are kept off the record.
that you, Salesian? I'm so sorry. I screwed up. Please, stop this. They, they want my...
I have a favor to ask. If at all possible, do you think I could accompany you? As Professor Hamilton's student, this situation with Professor Callahan isn't entirely unrelated to me, and I very much consider it my job to do something about it in her stead. Please, let me come with you. <laughs> 